In our previous session, we had introduced the zero investment innovative idea of learning with empty wrappers. Therefore, let's begin implementing this innovative idea starting today with some interesting hands-on activities and inquiry-based approach. Through this, we will be explaining to our students the concept of Standard Units of Measuring Volume A day prior to beginning this lesson, we shall ask the students to bring an empty wrapper or an empty carton of some liquid item from their homes or surroundings to the classroom the next day. We are now ready to begin. Inform the students that we are going to do an interesting activity in the classroom to introduce them to the standard units of volume. Ask the students to take out their empty wrappers or cartons. Then ask the students to go through the various information given on the packaging and to note down their observations in their notebooks. Why the students are engaged in noting down their observations, we shall proceed to draw a table on the blackboard as shown. Through this, we will be leading our students to understand the concept of standard units of measuring volume. So, once the students are done, we will ask them some leading questions based on their observations. As each student responds to our questions, we will fill out the table on the blackboard with the information they provide. Begin by asking each student, what was there in your wrapper or carton originally? The students may respond by saying, juice, milk and so on. Then ask, what all is mentioned on the wrapper? Accept all relevant responses from the students. Continue to ask, how much liquid was there in it originally? Allow the students to respond. As the students try to find the quantity of the liquid, it will hone their critical thinking skills. Once all the students have shared their observations and the table is complete, we will inform them that 1 litre is equal to 1000 milliliters. We will then conclude by informing the students that lesser quantities of liquid can be measured in milliliters, whereas bigger quantities of liquid can be measured in litres. Tune in to our next video where we will be revising the concept of determining the sum and difference of volumes by implementing the same innovative idea of learning with empty wrappers.